to another CCC Christian Click channel video, and today is a very good day. I have been awaiting this video to make this video for a while now. Well, it's when it came. It just came today, so today is the unboxing. Have not unopened this yet. Of of the Marvel Legends series Stormbreaker. I had to put my phone in panoramic mode just just so I can see how big. Oh, excuse me. How big this box is. This box is absolutely massive. It's waist it's past my waist or barely up to my waist actually so we're i had to i literally have no desk space to open this so uh so we're gonna go get into this in just a second so out of the marvel legends series so far i have the power gauntlet which i did not make a video of so because i got this before i really started getting into youtube so i have the power gauntlet um and then this isn't part of the marvel legends series but I have this Stormbreaker from when um, either one of the Thor movies came out. I got it when I was little. It lights up and it's supposed to shoot something, but I don't have that anymore. <laughs> so, I have both of those. Is mine even recording? You just, there we go. I was just double checking that. So, I'm going to spin my chair back a bit. And I'm going to double check this to see how this looks. Alright, so I just checked it. It's looking pretty good. I mean, I, you can't really see my face in this too much. But you can see the box, and that's really all that matters. So we're just going to cut straight into this guy. Again, this is live reaction. Not really live, because you guys, it's a YouTube video. I'm not live streaming this, obviously. But you, I haven't yet to open this. It literally came in the mail about 30 minutes ago. And I had a stupid Zoom call for school that I had to do first. But, again, here we are. We were talking afterwards, and they wanted me to open on the Zoom call. I'm like, no, I gotta record a YouTube video. Oh, wow. <laughs> just, I open the box, and you just see it. Uh, just, you see Thor's face holding it. This is going to be in quite the sight to see. I am so excited for this thing. I know, I've seen the box in person a couple times at GameStop, and uh, think and Think Geek, which is another store. Sort of like GameStop, if you've ever been to GameStop, but with just the collectible stuff. Come on. Technical difficulties. Give me like 30 seconds. Here we go. I got the box. I mean, okay, I got the box out. Wow. This thing is quite cool. So, I'm going to get a closer, I'm going to give you guys a closer examination of the box real fast. Hold my phone out. Let me put this out of panoramic mode. There we go. Uh, so let's go ahead and get a full overview of the box. So the box, Stormbreaker Adventures in game. We have the axe on the front of the box, which this thing looks insane. The box looks pretty good in my opinion. So we got this. I just think it was so cool when I pulled the box out. All I see is Legend series and then the in game. So yeah, the box. I mean, it's pretty good to look at, but it's not... Oh, that's the back of the box. Okay, I was about to say... All right, here we go. There's the front of the box. Now, that is intimidating, for sure. This thing is very cool. All right, I'm going to go ahead and pull this guy out and get the camera set back up. I put this guy in... I put it back in panoramic mode, and, sort of, and now I'm going to have to open it from, like, the floor. I'm going to open it on the floor now. Wow. <laughs> thing is so cool. Surprisingly only two little pieces of tape that are barely holding the box together are on this particular side. So I assume they want me to open it on this side. Right off the bat there's the instruction manual saying 18 up notices and the manual on how to put it together I assume. Uh, right out the box. Right out front. Okay. Here we go. Oh yes. <laughs> The box is just so big, I can't even... Alright, so it comes in, it looks like about two pieces. That's everything in the box. It just slides out in one large piece. There's so much box. Holy cow, it's huge. Alright, there's two screws for some reason. Wow, alright. So there's the axe itself. is in this, pra this pra plastic. plastic stuff. Wow, I can't talk. And it's being held together by these very large zip ties. 
gonna go ahead and cut both of these guys real fast. Without cutting the axe. Alright. So here's the axe head, which is absolutely massive. Jeez, look at this thing. Oh, it's got a little covering in the box. And a, another covering on the top. And one on the bottom, too. Jeez. Wow, look at this thing. Squishy. So the plastic is almost squishy. Like this, these vines are almost are kind of squishy. So it's on the back. It looks pretty good all around, though. Yeah. The vines. Uh, it's got some writing on it. Uh, what does that say? It's really hard to read. Star Smith, I think. For I can't. I'm not even going to attempt to read that. All right. So there's the axe itself, and then the handle is in here. If I can get this guy out somehow. How in the? Okay. So I think I'm going to have to cut this cardboard possibly, or maybe. It, yeah, this cardboard is going to be up the rip for cut. So. I think that I think I need to go get new battery. I think I need to go get battery for this thing. Wow. I mean, I thought the power gauntlet was big when I bought it. Like this thing, just I mean, the it, it, power gauntlet's a glove, a giant glove, basically. But and and I know this is going to be a war axe, but it just it just dwarfs the size. This has got weight to it. Wow. This is like a, this feels like I'm holding an actual stick or a glove. So there's the axe. Wow. It. Not squishy, but it's a harder pla- it's like not completely hard, but it, it's hard to describe. And then there's a giant metal rod on the end, so I assume that's where to go. There's the back, the whole axe, or the whole hilt itself. Uh, and I believe that's everything in this box, except for those- yeah, that's everything in this box. So let's go ahead and I'll uh, try to assemble this. Jeez, this axe head's just massive holding it. Look at this. This is how big it is. It's huge. So the battery compartment, I believe, is right here. I've watched some YouTube videos. Yeah. So the battery compartment is right here where this vine is because I can feel it where it's almost disconnected itself already. All right, let me look at the instructions real fast. So, and I need to go get batteries, which I'll pause the camera and get batteries for the thing. Um, so it says that step one is that they just pop this whole panel is supposed to like there's a button down here too so I assume that's going to make have make sounds so this is supposed to pop off but alright give me a second where did my remote starter go it's a mess and I don't even know where my starter my remote starter went during the top of the videos. Oh, it's up here. I'm gonna uh, try to get this apart real fast. It took, I had to watch a YouTube video, it took me forever, but I did get it off. So if you do own one of these, it does sound like it wants to die when it comes off. It, you think you break it, but it doesn't. You have to like, wedge. I wedge the scissors, you have to push this prong like in, and then it pops up, and then you have to push it like back and down. It was really complicated. To get down. Well, the battery, and then opens the battery compartment. So I'm gonna get bat. So I'm gonna go get batteries real fast. Okay, guys, I got the last two batteries. So we're putting the last two batteries in. Please don't jump scare me. Oh gosh, it did. <laughs> wow, I don't know if you guys can see that, but it lights up. That was quite insane. So I think it's motion activated too. So. That's pretty cool. And it's, I just, so let me get the, shh, yeah, let me get the battery pack there. Oh, okay, that's loud. That's very loud. How do I get the battery pack back on? Oh, I need to screw the panel back on. I'm an idiot. Hold up. Okay, so then what you're going to do is you're going to want to screw this back in. I 
had some sort of spasm there, but I don't know why. So then, I want to. You're gonna thrust the pin or this. If it would shut up for ten seconds, push that in. Ooh, that's stiff. That's very stiff. And then you got two screws in this little baggie here that you're gonna want that will go into the hole. These holes here, which. I believe I have to be like that. I don't know why I keep doing that. Come on, just go in. Why is this? It's just a little stiff. Hang on, this thing's huge. There we go. This little, it's a little stiff getting in, in there. I think that's... Wait, did I pass the hole? I don't know why I keep doing that. I'm sort of confused. Oh, yeah. Well, I gotta get the holes. Seem to get the hole in. I'm gonna have to cut this whole part out. Uh, I about got it back together. Just about. I gotta figure out. So does it A. I don't know why it keeps doing that. It keeps going off like that, and I don't know why. So uh, I dropped it. Trying to get this piece back on. There we go. I think we got it back on. Did we get it back on? Feels like it is. So these line up fairly nicely up here, so like that. Holy cow. Okay, give me a second. <laughs> I feel like the God of Thunder. <laughs> Look at this thing. This thing's insane. I'm going to give my final thoughts and then I'll end the video. Oh, I guess I'm going to... Alright, so this thing is, pretty, is huge overall. And pretty cool overall. Definitely buy. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And stay tuned for the next part. The next video, I guess.